Hello friends, today we are going to see how to use an aggregator function. I have already imported this source aggregator source a double pl underscore source flat file. My flat file is look like this. I have employee ID, name of the employee, department ID, and the salary of the employee. And today I am going to do work on aggregator function and going to count the max salary the total number of employees and the count the sum of salary Here is my mapping np underscore ag underscore example. Here, what I have done, I have imported this source and use this aggregator transformation. Go to the transformation, click create. Here, the aggregator, the name of the aggregator, press done. Once you press it done, it will pop up this window, drag this column from source analyzer to the aggregator function now what I am going to do I will add some output code which will calculate some of the salary max salary and count of employees go to port tab add new port to this task formation max underscore salary it is my output code it will be my output code then click uncheck the input code click on the space mark give max max is an aggregator function inbuilt function go to code and select salary like this validate the changes perfect code like this I am going to create Sum of salary sum sum underscore salary it will be integer a positive number so uncheck the input port do same for here use aggregator function sum and the port using salary so validate it press ok same i will do for count of employee count underscore employee it will give me the number of employees working in same department Count underscore port will be ID. It will be employee ID. Validate it. Press OK. The main thing is that I am going to group the salary, max salary, and sum of salary by department ID. So group by department ID. Check on this button. Press apply. OK. And what you want to do is you have to connect the aggregated transformation port this sum of salary max salary and count to the target like this click and drag sum click and drag for max salary click and drag for count of input like this save the changes once you save the changes, you have to create a session for send. I have created this session. The thing you have to do is you have to give the source and target file name. I have to give the source file directly like this. As my file is on, 
the desktop I have given the path of the desktop you give the name of the source file here like this you have to give the same for target file I have given my target file directory will be my desktop and my output file directory name will be aggregator underscore target dot txt ok click save and run the workflow once you run the workflow the monitor will start as here, here we can get the session is running the session was succeeded from source I got 5 records and get inserted 3 records into target I would like to show you how my target will look like here is my source and here is my target here is here is max salary here is max salary here is max salary here is count of salary and the number of employees working in department 10 is 2 same here we got for department 20 for department 20 the total salary is 9000 the max salary is 5000 the number of employees working in department 20 are 2 same for department 30 the max salary and count of employees and the salary is 20,000 thank you for watching